It would not be a slumber party without summoning some spirits, while that usually means ordering tequila shots in the clubhouse. Tonight it means playing Housewife of Horrors. I have spooky questions for the both of you. Take these flashlights and let's dim the clubhouse lights. Okay? Clubhouse? Yeah, clubhouse lights. Sorry. Um, sorry about that. I just did a shot. And we'll let that um, slide. Kyle. Yes, sir. Scariest this text you've ever received from a fellow housewife. Is this what's turn them on. on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. Okay. Just um, turn them on the bottom. Yes. Oh yeah, thanks. Scariest Andy. text you've received from a fellow housewife. From Brandy Glanville. From Brandy Glanville saying what? Responding to a text that she was trying to respond to someone else, and she called me a "see you next Tuesday." Uh, okay. And it was not supposed to be for me. Kathy, <laughs> which of your friends is scarier when she's upset, Chris Jenner or Faye Resnick? You know they don't get upset. That's not funny, Kathy. You gotta trust me. <laughs> no, no, after <laughs> filming Ultimate Girls Trip, name one housewife who you would be frightened to go on vacation with again. Um, oh God, frightened to go. I, I, I um, uh, Ramona. Uh, I'm gonna ask. I'm gonna ask Melissa Gorga the same question. <gasps> Melissa Gorga. Um, you were on the Ultimate. I'm gonna Girls have to double down. <laughs> You're gonna double down on Ramona. But she also made me laugh. My. Okay, yes, she's too funny. She Kathy, is. what is the most horrifying behavior a celebrity friend has ever exhibited at one of your parties? Who would you say? Remember when Monica's friend slapped that guy? Yes, but who was that? <laughs> who slapped the person? Somebody slapped the guy from the Stray Cats. So, oh, Brian Setzer? What was Setzer? His name again? No, the other one. He was married to Britt Eklund. Yeah, and he slapped him. Oh, my God. He slapped somebody. At a, somebody. At a holiday party. Kyle, <laughs> be honest. Were you a little bit relieved or frightened that Mauricio and PK questioned Erica's story so you and Dorit didn't have to? Uh, we were both really scared, and, you know, it was a very uncomfortable moment. But you can't control those guys, you know. And my, by the way, you know, my husband adores Erica, but they had questions. A lot of people do. Kathy, how frightened were you going into your first reunion, and did you come out unscathed? I wasn't frightened. I was, uh, I mean, it was very interesting, and it was, uh, it was wild. It was wild. <laughs> You brought, you brought a list of receipts. You did bring a list with I you, did. which I really enjoyed. You know why? Because I, because everybody thought that I just didn't show up to Garcelle's party. Okay. And, and I was told to... not to okay. because I had but not been feeling well. Right, you did, right. Exactly. And I am not an impolite COVID. person and right. I adore her. Okay. And I have manners, damn it all. Yes, you do. Thank you very much, ladies. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.